hello friends welcome back to tutorials in this tutorial we will learn how we can perform subtraction by using radix complement suppose there are two numbers a and b of n digits and their base is r suppose we have to subtract the number b from number a then what will we do we will first find the R's complement of number B. Then we will add A to the R's complement of B. If the sum of A and R's complement of B produces and carry, then it means A is greater than B. We will discard the and carry and whatever is left in the sum would be a minus b it would be the desired result if their sum doesn't produce any and carry then it means b is greater than a then A minus B will be the negative of R's complement of sum. It would be more clear after we will study these examples. Now, suppose there are two numbers. These are two decimal numbers. One is 750 and other one is 840 and we have to subtract 840 from 750 then what will we do first we will find the tens complement of 840 and it is equal to 160 then we will add this 160 to 750 right when we add these two numbers, we will get 910. Now, this sum produces no AND carry. So, the result would be the minus of tens complement of this sum. Right? So, the tens complement of 910 is 90 and it's uh, when we will put a negative sign in front of it then it will become minus 90 so what we have to do we have to find the r's complement of a number to which we are going to subtract from the other number right we will find first its r's complement and then add it with the other number right and if the sum doesn't produce any and carry right then the result would be the minus r's complement of the sum now suppose we have to subtract 750 from 840 then what will we do here the r is 10 base is 10 first we will find the 10th complement of 750 and add it with 840 10th complement of 750 is 250 now we will add it with 840 the result would produce an and carry right now we will discard this and carry and whatever is left in this sum would be the desired result. Here, when we discard this and carry 1, what is left is 90. So, the result is 90. When we subtract 750 from 840, the result would be 90. Now, suppose there are two binary numbers, right? And we have to find their difference. Here, 
the base of numbers is 2. Suppose we have to subtract this number 1001 from this number that is 1111. So what will we do? First we will find the 2's complement of this second number 1001. Now 2's complement of 1001 is 0 1 1 1. Now we will add this number to first number that is 1 1 1 1. When we add these two numbers we will get 1 0 1 1 0. Now here this one is and carry. Right. So what will we do? We will discard it. Now what is left in sum? After discarding the AND carry is the desired result. So here what is left? 0, 1, 1, 0. So 0, 1, 1, 0 is the desired result. Now suppose we have to subtract 1, 0, 1, 1. It's a binary number. From another binary number 1, 0, 0, 1. Now what will we do? First we will find the 2's complement of this second number 1 0 1 1 which is 0 1 0 1. Now add this 2's complement to the first number. Now when we add 0 1 0 1 to 1 0 0 1 what will we get? 1 1 1 0. Now here the sum produces no AND carry. So the result would be minus 2's complement of this sum. Right? 